Toastmasters, the Toastmaster, my fellow Toastmasters, and guests. Most of us join Toastmasters for various reasons. Chris, why do you want to join Toastmasters? Here's my experience. Okay, and Manish, why did you join? Pretty much same. Okay, Jennifer? I build my confidence. Excellent. Thank you very much. The reason I joined was to build my confidence and to get more experience and leadership and improve my communication skills. Well, today I'd like to present a proposal to you, and that proposal is to increase membership and increase your participation by expanding your horizons beyond the 30. Now generally, there's an average of about six <coughs> members in attendance at Toastmasters meetings. And when we have such a low attendance, what happens is one person has to take on more than one role. And by increasing attendance, we'll be able to take the burden off one person thereby allowing that one person to do their role, role much better. So the plan is for each club member to make a commitment to attend weekly meetings, by weekly meetings, try weekly, or make a hard, hard commitment to attend meetings at least once per month. And that way, you're, you will reach your goal, your personal goal. So when you attend meetings, if you attend just that one meeting, make it count. Be prepared to give a speech or take on a leadership role. Also, when you take on the leadership roles like president, vice president, education, membership, public relations, secretary, or sergeant at arms, what you're doing is expanding yourself and preparing yourself for the next level. When you do, when you do those roles in the club level, you're gonna be able to do them at the district level, which is expanding yourself beyond that 30. The district consists of top three. There are three top positions, and that's the district governor and the lieutenant governor of education and training and the Lieutenant Governor of Marketing. How many knew that? <coughs> Is anyone aware of the district top three? Does anyone know who they are? You know, Lisa Walkus, is she one of them? She is currently, okay. yes, very good. Anybody else? Can you say, oh, okay. uh, To be Mike Bacon, Yes. Jack Pyle, which position is Jack taking? Jack is education. Okay. Probably communication, knowing his background. <laughs> Marketing. Marketing, yeah. Yes, yes. And I don't know who the third one is. The third one is Carol Waterstadt. You wouldn't know who she is. But I have some information in the handout where Carol gave a presentation that would tell you a little bit more about her. Also, I figured out a way to intertwine the district meeting into my presentation today, and that's by telling you what happened at the conference, as well as to encourage you to encourage others to attend meetings. Now, our club president has a proposal where each member invite other members so you make phone calls to make connection with other members to encourage them to attend meetings. And another extension of that that I like to propose is that each member bring someone, bring a friend, family, anyone you know that might be interested. And that is to increase our membership base beyond what it currently is. I think we have a membership base of 23, and we're now at 19. We have been working hard to attain the goal points so that we can be distinguished. But well, now we are a distinguished club. But unless we have 
the number of members that are at our base, 20 or above, we're not gonna get any credit for it. So we need to have at least one more men member so we can get credit for all of those goal points that we've had worked hard for. Another advantage of attending club meetings and attending district conferences is you get to watch firsthand the international speech contest, the evaluation contest, the tall tales contest, <coughs> and there's one more. Who knows what it is? Humorous? Beg your pardon? Say, is it humorous? Evaluation okay. humorous, yes, yes. Amongst us, we have a winner. And you, you get to find out this information by attending conferences, but our very own Manish Modi was a finalist in the Humorous Speech Contest in 2006. And also, he was the winner in the District Evaluation Contest in 2000. <laughs> so these are some things that you get to experience by stretching your talents, what you've learned here in the club. So I'd like to make a proposal that we consciously attend meetings, at least one meeting per month, and encourage other <coughs> members to attend as well, and also to bring a guest and go beyond the 30 by attending district conferences as well as attending other club meetings. Thank you very much. to one conference and it was great. I would recommend going. I'm going to ask you to fill out the evaluation form for Mary. I'll give you one minute to do that. Maybe. 